Hello. So I'm on my way out to the field to get Freya to ride today. And it's going to be the first time that I've ridden in five days, maybe six. I think six, actually. Anyway, she's had an entire week off um, due to the holidays and then also rain. We got about six inches of rain in a week's time. And the arena was just too wet. The field was too wet. I mean, everything was just nasty. So I didn't get to ride her. And yesterday when I went to ride her, or at least pulled her in to ride, she was just a ball of anxiety. And I think a lot of that had to do with me pulling her out of the field, away from the other horses. And I left them out, which normally I don't do. I put them up when I go to work her. So today I'm going to do that again because I think I need to start working on that. And I'm going to put her in, see how she does. If we have to go through the same process as yesterday, then so be it, which basically was it took an hour and a half for her to calm down enough, standing on the cross ties without moving, relaxing, um, well, it took an hour and a half to get her to that point. She wanted to move around a lot. And, well, she would try and push her body towards me if I was brushing her or something. So I had to keep pushing her away. And really, I just wanted her to stop moving back and forth. I wanted her to stand still and just chill. And that was hard. So it took an hour and a half before I finally got her to stand still and chill. And then after that, I just said, let's just skip, excuse me, skip riding today. So after that, I said, let's just skip riding today. That was our big work on thing. And so now I'm going to be riding and we'll see how it goes. My expectations are pretty low. But I am hoping that she'll do well. All right, so first ride in six days. No, ma'am. Back. And no, back. Thank you. And we're going to go through all the basics first, just to make sure that she's paying attention to me and reminder of what I expect of her. Good girl. So, ask her to walk to the arena. And then we're just going to come into the arena. Whoa. Oh. Good girl. All right. I'm going to ask her to flex. And again, I don't want her feet to move. I want her to give to me. As you can see, there I got it. So, I'll release. No, ma'am. Ho. So, I'm going to ask her to flex. Good girl. I'm going to ask her to flex this way. She wants to move around. I'm just going to hold it. Okay. Good girl. And flex her back this way. Good girl. And she did much better on the cross ties today than yesterday. But there's still some nervousness about her, which all is because I left the other horses out. And they're out right now. And she can see them. And that's what she's looking at right now. There she just breathed out a sigh. So that's good. No, ma'am. She's testing, though.
work on one ring stop. So walk. So I don't have her attention as well as I would like to have it. So we're going to have to be mindful of that. And what I'm wanting to see today is after six days off, where are we going to be at with the trot? Um, let's work on a little one wing stop right here. Slide it low out. Let it stop. She's not thinking at me. The rain is loose though, so just waiting, waiting, waiting. I don't want you to move. Good girl. That's what I wanted. No, ma'am. Nope. Not till I say move. So, nope. Not till I say move. Good girl. I don't have my watch right. Walk. I definitely don't have very much of her attention today. That's better. Nope. Let her commit to the mistake. Now ask her to stop. I didn't ask her to go. Right. Let her think through it. Now walk. I almost was her choice, so I have to keep that in mind. So I'm really trying, no, nope. let her commit to it, ask her to stop again, good girl. We definitely have a lot of anxiety to work on. Walk. So that's a lot of what I'm trying to work through now, still. And I'm figuring out when it gets bad, 
which is like now, which is pretty similar to the situation at the trainers. When we get there, there'd be horses all out in the pasture and nobody with her. And that would bring on anxiety. Or if a new horse did come into the arena, then that would give her some anxiety. So I'm trying to ride. Good girl. Walk right now. With the other horses out where she can see them so that not only it creates some of that anxiety I get when I take her to the trainers but that we have something to work on too because I want to be able to take her places so we've got to just work through this to the right and she's doing really good with going in the direction that I want her to um, when I start to pick up, that shoulder starts to go, and I do. I like that. That's good. I still don't have her attention, though. She wants to see what the other horses are doing. So, basically, I'll be working on this for a little while until I have her full attention, and I feel like we can possibly trot some so i'm going to work on that and then i'll come back and film more if we're able to make it to the trot if not we're going to keep working on who exactly what we've been doing all right so we've been walking around for another probably 15 minutes since i cut off the video before she's gotten little calmer she's listening to my cues much better walk you can see she's not walking off without me asking her to um, she's listening to my leg really good too breathed out and released the tension um, so I think we're in a good place good girl. all right walk so we're gonna try to add in a little trotting um, see how it goes all right trot Oh, walk. Good girl. Good girl. Head down. Head down. There we go. All right, walk. Walk. Good girl. touch the reins too much. She kept her head low at the trot. I like that. Try going this way. Trot. Easy. Easy. Too fast. That's okay. That's okay. I did think through that. I figured this direction she'd go a little faster because her friend's over there, Barnes there, so walk. I figured it would be a test, and it went how I expected, so. I can't believe she wanted to do that on her own, but we'll go with it. All right, trot. Easy, easy, go. one rain stop here, good girl, there,
There we go. It's not bad for today, considering what I, how I thought today was going to go. What this tells me is that my instinct is correct. I really need to go slower than what I was. Oh, there's a turkey trot. There's a trot, sorry. It's a trick walk. But anyway, so my instinct is right. I just need to go really slow. And when I feel she's already on edge, I don't need to push it at that point. I need to work through the anxiety first. And then move on to, you know, adding speed and all. But she, for having six days off, um, and I mean, I didn't do anything. Now, yesterday I did come out and just ground walk her over the bridge and over the poles just to mess with her and get her thinking and stuff. But, I mean, to have six days off, and not be ridden, not be tacked up. I thought today was pretty good. I feel like rides like this will help her build confidence and trust in me again. And we definitely really lost it. And so, just could be a slow process, but this, this went well. Ho, ho, ho. Head down. Good girl. Back. 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 Good girl. So, my goal for January is to get to where we can trot around on a loose rein keep a steady pace. The anxiety is completely gone. And so January is just going to be continuing to do the same. And I will continue to do a weekly update to show where she's at. Um, but since I won't be adding anything new, the updates will be pretty um, short compared to this video. This ended up being a little bit longer than I had anticipated wanting it to be, but she did good. She's a good girl. Yeah.